Spray processes, such as for cleaning or for coating, are very common in manufacturing. As a result, many manufacturers need a way to visualize and characterize the spray pattern. This is difficult because even when the line pressure may be extremely high, the actual applied pressure on the part is extremely low. Here I'm going to use a tact array system to look at the difference in spray patterns of some different sources of compressed air. I have a conformable tact array sensor that I've taped down onto this piece of plastic as a backing, and I've covered it with some plastic wrap to protect the sensor. I'll use this to look at the air patterns from three different sources of compressed air. First, using this nozzle, which I can watch on the screen here. Now, we'll switch to a more precision nozzle used in electronics manufacturing. Now we'll look at even lower pressures coming from this can of compressed air. PPS customers have used tact array systems such as this one for a variety of spray processes. One customer used it to evaluate coating processes used in the manufacture of magnetic media for hard drives. A government agency even used a tact array system to validate the safety of different spray cannons for pepper spray.